It's been a while since since when did that did yeah exactly it's been a while since we've done some of these uh, hey there everyone it is December sixth and like so I think it's only a matter of time we're in like within a certain tradition sub traditions sort of like start happening and this is kind of the thing like for a while now in the advent on December sixth which is today. Uh, we would normally open up a gift from Belmore and or Mikofire, where it come from Finland, because it is the Finland Independence Day. And although, technically speaking, the Advent this year doesn't start until the 13th, for one of those, you know, 12 days of Christmas type of deal... Uh, we're still not gonna break tradition. Mikofire sent me a box... Uh, independent of the normal, usual channels to get this going. Uh, he cheated, and he sent this to my address directly. Now, uh, I have to say it, it did not come in this uh, Christmas bag. It came in the normal box, but then the ghost of Christmas ghost was like, no, let's put, no, I'm gonna put this in the Christmas bag. <laughs> so, I, I don't know if, like, anything changed because of that. Okay, it looks like the content are all in their own plastic bags of some kind. Oh, that is heavy. And there are two boxes that are just, check it out, and check it out. Uh, okay, so no letters, just go and ride in. Talvi Suko, Pualuka Carpado. Oh, it's lactose and lactose free. Okay, I get it. Uh, well, this does not tell me what this is. <laughs> and it's a bottle of some kind. Wait, wait, wait. Coated foam sweets. That is an extremely, uh, extremely literal translation. <laughs> oh, okay. It's probably this. Ooh, that does look good. That does look good. Oh, that does look good, though. Okay. Oh, and there's like a few of them. And here we got... Viheta Kuria Grona Kuro. I don't know how to pronounce Finn. It's vegan. Yeah, it's green balls. I mean, I guess it's green balls. Fruit marmalade jellies. Oh, what? Fruit marmalade jellies. Oh, that sounds good. Oh, I haven't can eaten candy in a hot minute. Oh, that sounds good. Okay. Okay. Um, this one is, like, massive. This one is a little bit less massive. So let's just, whoa, do a little flip. 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 Hey, ho. 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 This is just, like, outright chocolate. <laughs> Gosh, Bowser. My... My tosukla. Oh, milk chocolate. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that tracks. Just flat out finish milk chocolate. Like, is that this thing from milk chocolate? Maybe. I, I do not know. I do not have the required knowledge to understand this. Oh, but that, like, this thing. Like, I don't know if you can tell by the way it bounces in my hand. But this thing is hefty. Like, like it's not, like, super thick. You know, here's a... Uh, Here's an imaginary watermelon for scale. Imagine there's a watermelon there. Yeah, so use that for scale. But uh, there's a there's a heftiness to it. I I don't hate that. And and uh, here's the wonder log here. We're just gonna roll. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, that makes sense. And then make a mindrasat pomac. Look, man, these are letters. Okay, you got a server as well have killed. That's good to know. <laughs> I don't know what things are. Help. Okay, so let's see here. One of the ingredients is vatten and soccer. Okay, so it's windy soccer. I get it. Now, well, let's see. Like, there's fruits and vegetables and stuff all around it. Like, in the drawing. <laughs> Maybe it's wine? In, like, a soda bottle? That doesn't make any sense. No, that can't be. But it's probably a fruit something. 
It's the it's the it's the casket there that made me wonder. Maybe it's cider. Oh, that could be it. I, I don't know. I need context. Help! <laughs> Help! <laughs> oh, I love this. Oh, I forgot how fun it is to open things up like this. Thank you, Mikafier. Happy Finnish Independence Day. Um, I know I need to be careful about what I eat in terms of sugar, but I'll see what I can do about all of this. Oh, that is so cool. That is so nice. That is so cool. Thank you. Uh, and yeah, I guess I'll put the digital part after this. Out there somewhere. Okay, so this is the part two. Hopefully I can stitch the film, like, film footage and this footage. I've done it before, and it was effortless. I don't know why I'm so worried it's gonna be like a whole thing. It's not. Like, it's fine. Ow, cow. Stop being weird. We got two petting gifts waiting for us. It's not on know what to expect, which is what makes it so fun. Here we go. Oh, I... Corn kids? Corn kids? <laughs> what does that mean? Ambush! I've been following your Let's Play since 2008. That's still essay time, is it? Is that when I start on YouTube? And your commentary always puts a smile on my face. Love your banjo LP, so I hope you enjoy this one. Stan says best wishes. Shikiru Robot is a name I definitely remember. Corn kids, look at that. Har somewhat hard to read uh, thumbnail. <laughs> the unauthorized kid-friendly version of the classic psychic thriller. <laughs> All right, well, uh, launch trailer sounds just as one month ago. That is a, that is a recent outing. Yo, okay. Yeah, and apparently uh, the internet's at 360p or something right now, so sorry about that. Well, you can see, uh, CRT lines, actually, so I'm thinking, wow, that is, that is extremely Banjo-Kazooie. Banjo-Kazooie with a dash? Okay, I kinda get it. Old Mayor Hollow's out of town. That's a squishy-looking pig there, you got, son. Ooh, no, honestly, this looks, like, really good. Like, there is this N64 revival going on, you know, and uh, I think it's shocking how extremely people get it. Like, this, you if you had told me this is like lost footage of an N64 creepypasta game, I would, I would believe you. <laughs> Except, uh, you know, they probably do things N64 wouldn't be able to do, which is great, but no, yeah, this looks... I don't know if I've ever heard of this before, but looking at this, this looks wild and su The effect on those Wrecking Ball there, I love the way it flashed. <laughs> That's pretty good. Check out the mirror, break it and go inside a portal. It irises out using a shape. Corn Kid 64! <laughs> That's a name. Then we go through an infinite arch. That's pretty good. That look! Super cool. Corn Kid 64. Like, for real. That looked like... This is an XP cube. Alright, now I know everything I need to know about XP cubes, too. That's what it is. It's a little, little red cube. Uh, right in the same discussion here as Pseudo Regalia, which... Yeah, 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 that would make sense. Uh, huh. Nitro Rat is still a person. <laughs> I feel like it's been a while since I've seen such a... Thumbnail. Thank you, Stan! That- this looks super great! Uh, in your task of putting a game in front of my eyes and making me acknowledge it, task achieved. Uh, my curious has been spun. And then Mikofire! Whoa, Mikofire's back! I just- I just opened up your box full of stuff. Hey, uh, Raokow, did you know December 6th finished Independence Day? Raokow, did you know that, Raokow? Also, Remedy is a Finnish company, did you know that? I'm sure I knew that one once upon a time. <laughs> Nickafire, I'm glad you got to put some words in. That, all right, Alan Wake. I think we all know what Alan Wake is. Well, I'm gonna accept the gift of Alan Wake. Alan Wake is a bit more. I don't know if it's AAA. I mean, it's a bit more. 
it's the kind of game that, you know, game review site would actually talk about and stuff. So, you know, acknowledged. But, uh, yeah, it's like a horror game. You're going around the flower. I might as well look at a trailer. All right, well, what I was gifted was the remastered specifically, so might as well pop on that, Nacho. The Sheriff's Department's still looking for a Yeah, see, like, the vibe immediately old, is very, uh... I mean, immediately, it is evoking a little bit of Silent Hill, I feel like. Well, I'm not used to playing games with, like, fancy graphics like this, though. <laughs> Gonna run over that guy, idiot! That's for a new generation. No one can read that sign on the side of the bridge. We're supposed to be on vacation, Alice. I wish you a good stay in my cabin. I'll come by later to check how you've settled in and to meet your wife. And that does look really nice. I'm not used to games looking like that. But yeah, it's a horror game. I wish they would show more of the game and less of the cutscenes, though. I mean, that's always how I'm at about the about 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 trailers. Don't show me the story. Show me like what the game is about and let me experience the game when it happens in the game. Unless it's a story game, in which case, oh yeah, there's not a whole lot you can do. However, this is maybe okay. There we go. Like maybe the game, the trailer is more for people who've already played it. Well, that's not me. Well, we saw a little bit of a gameplay. <laughs> there we go. The person is like on fire, but like without fire, it's pretty good. Like I think that's on purpose. Like they're going for something. Like 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 that's like what the supernatural is like. Oh, it's you. Wake up. Wish show more game. <laughs> show me more game. If you want to wow me, show me game. But yeah, that's Alan Wake. It's a horror game. I feel like it does kind of is heavily inspired by the quiet mounds of dirt that are over there. Uh, but you know, it's, uh, it's you go around, you got a flashlight. Like darkness is a big thing. Dark and light is a big thing. Dark and light can make really cool visual things with that. Video games are video games. You can put them on your face and you won't suffocate. Well, unless you leave it there for too long. Then like you know, I like look, man, I'm not I'm not legally responsible for anything that happens to you. No matter what you're doing, like in the next like couple minutes. Nope. I got nothing to do with it. Airtight alibi. I was sitting here on my chair, staring at a wall.